Hey everyone, in the last lesson we have done the uh, lighting calculation and we have done everything we need inside Dialex Evo. Now the next step is that, okay, you would like to save? Save now, okay. <laughs> okay, I just remember something when uh, it wanted to save. Okay, you can see after we added all of these luminaires, you can see in the 3D view, you can see all of the rooms now with the light turned on okay after you added everything so as you can see this is the meeting room which we have added you can see all of the colors almost white in every uh, single room okay so this is how your own uh, room will look like after you add all of the luminaires okay so this is just for illustration okay really nice Okay, what is the next step? Next step is that we would like to export this one into an um, AutoCAD file. Okay, so we start doing the uh, connections, add everything we need, and so on. So we click on export. Okay, now we will find here in export three options. We will need the third one, which is the plans. Okay, in order to export it into um, an AutoCAD file. Now, this is the layers which you can add into the Dialex Evo, uh, into the AutoCAD file, okay? What is important for me is that first is the luminaire list, the list of luminaires which I have used and their quantity. Also, you will find here the uh, these two uh, first options such as room design nations. Uh, here, window and doors are not important, objects are not important, calculations are not important. This is just the three options which is important for me. Now, also you can find here what you would like to do, what version of AutoCAD you would like. Usually I use 2013 because I have 2013 and 2018, okay? And also most of my own students have 2013, okay? And this is the unit of measurement, which is meters. Now, um, let's export it. We will export it to an existing file, which is the plan export to existing file you can see this is the plan which are using um which one floor one lighting this is the one which i am using this is a pure autocad plan for this uh, room which i have give you the link to it okay of this uh, building okay or the floor of this building okay the first floor of this building so i would like to add the luminaires and this plan to this autocad file so we'll double click on this one and you can see it exported and ended exporting okay now what are we going to do you can see this file here where it is where this file where 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 okay this is the autocad file floor one lighting dwg this is the one which i've just added to it this um, plan okay now we can simply double click on it like this double click on this one and we can open it inside autocad okay but i'm going to show you another thing okay you already know how to open autocad from the course uh, but i would like to show you how can use autocad for free because many of my students are looking for a free version of autocad or would like to use AutoCAD without any license okay so there is a method here this website web.autocad this is uh, related to the AutoCAD website this gives you an access web.autocad.com this gives you an access by just creating an account you will have an access to use the AutoCAD program for free okay you don't need to download the AutoCAD program. You can use it for using this website. Okay. This is a, just an extension of AutoCAD. Web.AutoCAD. Now, simply we'll click on upload to upload our file. Okay. AutoCAD first floor lighting. Where is it? This one. Okay. We will first upload it and start opening it inside this um, web AutoCAD. Okay, remember that you can, you learn it in the course, how can you use the uh, downloaded version of AutoCAD, and this we are going to learn quickly, how can I use the online version. Okay, just we are waiting for the uploading of the file. So now the file is uploaded, simply we'll go to floor one, click on it, 
like this you can see initializing autocad now as you can see we have opened uh, our autocad file as you can see here this is our file it is pretty close to the autocad which you are using in the desktop now this is the plan which i have used in the design right now what is the problem <laughs> the problem is that as you can see here um where is the uh, dialex file where is the luminaires which we have added this luminaires where are these luminaires where the, we have only the plan now if you look carefully you will find here a small uh, yellow uh, part here this yellow part is uh, um, the uh, file added by dialex if you come if you zoom in like this okay you will see this uh, poor guy <laughs> okay you can see here the luminaire list okay building one floor one uh, here's the index one two three four this is the index for the luminaires used we use the five types of phillips the first one is tbs165 second one is rc and so on okay the last two is uh, weather proof okay and you can see here um, there uh, how many uh, lamps used inside this luminaire luminous flux the uh, maintenance factor the load this load how much uh, power it is using and the quantity used we used from this type 9 used from this one uh, 35 we used from this one 1 used from this one 9 and so on okay so as you can see here the luminaire have index 2 what does 2 mean and uh, besides the luminaire itself 2 means this type rc400b okay and 1 means this type which is uh, tbs165 okay so this is the luminaire list which you can use in the lighting legend okay and the pill quantity now what are we going to do we would like to resize this one we would like to make this one a little bit bigger okay so we can use it in the other room so we can say uh, scale like this so as you can see scale uh, you don't know don't worry the program itself is slow okay not my own computer uh, the website itself is slow okay um here what you would like to scale for example i would like to scale this one okay all of this like this and all of this and how we would like to scale let's say for example um okay let's say base point like this this one okay and how much you would like to scale so let's zoom out so as you can see the you can see the program uh, my own computer is really fast however the website itself is really really slow okay so anyway anyway we are not going to use this uh, because the video will be very very long okay so i'm going to use my own uh, autocad uh, program in order to uh, do this okay so the website is okay a good alternative to all of this however it is really really slow okay so i'm going to open my own autocad uh, program and start um, doing the rest of what we are going to do.